So, yeah. In winter, the sun rises around 8 a.m. But lectures can start as early as 8 a.m. For me, this means leaving home just as the sun rising. However, some of my friends have lectures that start at 7.30 a.m., so they're walking to class when it's completely dark outside. At first, this was a bit strange to adjust to, but over time, I got used to it. It's all part of the experience, and once you're in the routine, it becomes just another part of your day. One thing I did not expect is the big amounts of mails I get. In my home country, we nearly never use mails. We don't even have mailboxes, we need to rent one. But here, it automatically comes with your accommodation. So basically, everything I got, such as health insurance documents, registration, bank details, debit card, and even some random advertisements all through the mail. So I have to check my mailbox regularly. The weather here is no joke, especially in winter. It is still November and it is getting really cold and rainy. It even snowed last week. A good winter jacket, as well as waterproof boots, is a good idea. Always carry an umbrella with you as well. So this is also one thing I want to mention, which is the language barrier. My lectures are in German, and while my level is B2, it's honestly been tough. Professors often speak super fast, and during the first two weeks, I felt completely lost. But by the third or fourth week, I started to understand more. The key has been self-study, translating my notes and revisiting everything on my own. It's a lot of work, but it's helping me to keep up with the lecture. So if you're studying abroad and struggling with the language, know that it, it gets better. Just be patient and keep going.
today is sunny. Okay, so one thing I should definitely mention is cost of living. So first of all, I want to talk about groceries. For me, groceries usually cost about 30 to 40 euros per week, and I shop once a week. Of course, this can vary depending on your lifestyle and what kind of food you buy. It's different for everyone. I do want to talk more about the detailed cost of living, so how much you need per month. As you can see, the cost of living in Germany here is the biggest um, expense as rent, which typically ranges from 300 to 450 euros per month. Health insurance is another key expense. It's obligatory for international students and costs, of, and costs between 100 and 150 euros monthly. Then there are extras like pocket money, which I recommend budgeting around 30 to 50 euros. For some services like internet and, a, uh, and SIM card, expect to pay another 30 or to 50 euros per month. As for groceries, on average, you'll spend about 130 to 170 euros monthly, depending on where you live and shop. These numbers are based on my experience and what I've heard from my international student friends. Keep in mind, costs can vary depending on the city and on your personal lifestyle, but this gives you a general idea.
halt saubere Sie kommen auch durch die Übersetzung. Ingenieursmäßige Automobile. So, und dann die großen Prozesse entwickelt werden. I also want to mention the late lectures because we have early lectures and like we also have late lectures. This lecture uh, starts at 4 p.m. and finishes at 7.15 p.m., which is after sunset. And this is honestly for me a struggle because this is what usually like Maghrib time is. And like, this is a three hours lecture. So this is one of the struggles I have here. Um, but yeah, also the problem is that the sunset is now around 4 p.m., 4.30, 4 p.m. So that is also really early. Sushi time. Last thing I want to mention, which is something very surprising and actually really surprised me, is the Rundfunkgebühren. These are the rent, uh, I mean, sorry, this is the taxes of radio and TV. Even if you're not using them, radio and TV, you still have to pay the taxes. And it's usually written... Uh, every three months you pay 55 euros so you have to pay it every three months this was really surprising because nobody mentioned this so that was also one thing i wish i knew before coming to germany Thank you.